I roamed over raging seas on a path too bold to find all kinds of plunder I did not own. Drinking rum, I dulled my morals. Stealing, lying, sinking boats, I fought, I quarreled. I was fleeing from the truth, trying to be happy in earthly treasures. Blinded by pride, I hurt whoever, as long as I found pleasure. But on one fateful day, a day that can never be ignored, a stormy gale overwhelmed me ship and sent me overboard. I was swallowed by the ocean's abyss, imprisoned by the storm's firm fist. I couldn't see, I couldn't breathe. Me life ebbed away like the morning tide. But by some miracle, I did not die. A swirling watery funnel pushed me upward toward a silvery splinter that broke through the inky black like a candle's flicker. Suddenly, a hand, which I knew not the source, pulled me to safety onto an island's shores. For two days straight, I lay upon the sand, too weak to move, too weak to stand. Thirst finally drove me to my knees and beg, Dear God, please ease me pain. A strength came over me frail frame. I crawled and crawled and found shelter in a cold, damp cave, where upon its wall, I found scratch this thought. For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, and all are justified freely by his grace through the redemption that came by Christ Jesus. After reading these verses, I realized me wretchedness, that I was guilty, me sin had to be atoned for. Only God could redeem this lost pirate that no good work could open salvation's door. So I bowed me head and prayed once more. I repented of me wicked ways. I pledged myself to never be the same. I trusted in Jesus Christ, for he alone can save. While I was yet a sinful scallywag of a pirate, God loved me enough to save me, body, soul, and spirit. I did eventually get off that island, and now the seas I roam. But let me tell you, me mateys, knowing Jesus is the greatest treasure I have ever owned.